Hey YouTubers, it's me Mark Ortiz. I had to delete the video. I'm gonna reshoot it again. They had pulled the last vid that I uh, did on the audio, so I'm gonna re-head, go ahead and reshoot this vid. Just the A, because I did a B and a C. All right, I picked these up for John B. Got a gold jump man here, as you can see. All right. YouTube had went ahead and pulled that um the audio on there for copyright infringement. All right. We got that Air Jordan Retro 10 size 11 retailing at 190. Okay, we got a gold jump man right here. Receipt. Official receipt. Got it at 190. I, I went ahead and also copped the force field protector. It's like a crep protect, pretty much. Alright, let me see if we can grab that over here. Alright. The company was established in 2007, as you can see. Force field protector. It's effective for up to 12 months. Six ounces. It's kind of heavy. Of course, it's six ounces. I copped this for $12.99, as you can see there. All right. It's supposed to be just like Crep Protect, according to the uh, Foot Locker employees. They told me it's a great product. They actually did some testing and they uh, vouch for it. So I'm going to try it. I'll let you guys know how how this product is, by the way. I'll keep you guys posted. All right. Let me see. We got our 23 paper here. Got that gold speckling down at the bottom there. Great. Got all the uh, Jordan's accomplishments and accolades down at the bottom of the shoe. As you can see there, starting from his 85 rookie of the year season. 63 points in 86, scoring title 87. Dunk champion in 88, 89, all defense team. Score 69 points in 1990. MVP championship in 91, 92, and 93. And as you all know, 94, he was out. I went to go pursue his dream to become a baseball player, as you all know. Played for the Barons. The gold speckling. That glitter down at the bottom of this shoe is beautiful with that gold jump, man. You know, being that I'm from New York City, I had to pull the trigger on these. You got that gold speckle in there at the toe. All right. Got that gold NYC there. Shoe is real butter soft. It's soft. It's a smooth leather, but it's really plush. And as you all know, the tens are real comfortable. I like the tens. The tens are a real comfortable shoe. I like that pattern that the tens have. The lace lace up unit. All black tongue, as you can see there. It's really, really nice. All black midsole. Got that pull tab in the back. Black pull tab with gold. 
like Trump man in the back and the heel. Alright. Pull the strings out of here. date June 14th to 2015 December 15th 2015 I had the same thing on the other shoe the only thing is the production date end was 12 16 of 2015 okay right here on the tongue we got that Air Jordan logo it says uh City collection patch in the inner part of the tongue, there as you can see. All right, got the Air Jordan on number 23 down at the bottom of the Air Jordan on the tongue. Very nice, it's got that metallic touch, just like the Lady Liberties had. I wanted to get in the Bulls over Broadway. I gotta get the uh, Lady Liberties to add to the collection. But it's pretty much got that metal finish to it, just like the Lady Liberties did. All right. Get into the other shoe. Pull that one out. Let me know if you guys cop. What's your favorite shoe out of the pack? Whether it's dropped already or it's going to drop in the near future. It's not like pretty much like the old city pack that came out a long time ago. Some people like the new version city pack that's been coming out or is out. Some people like the old school stuff. It dropped many years ago. Just let me know what you guys think. Alright. As you guys know, I went ahead and copped that hat. The hat to match. See that? Got that hologram. I'm going to stick it there. forget to like subscribe come back again peace I'm out